Hello guys and welcome to my second inform review for Gavani. The I played him as a striker in a 4-1-2-1-2 um, alongside with Balotelli and with Boateng behind the two. At first I really didn't like him. It seemed like his finishing wasn't up to par to that 99 finishing it said he had. But after tweaking him and figuring out how to actually play with him I grew to love him actually his high high work rates was another problem usually he will think that he's a center of midfield because usually he has to follow the player all the way back to the center of the field and then come back and by the time I have a counter attack he's already tired and can't do anything for me so I would have to pass it off to another player and wait for him to recuperate from being tired but after about four games about that, I figured out that I shouldn't play on defensive mode because his high high work rates really drag him back. And I know I do like to play on defensive, but that's because I don't like to have my fullbacks go up at all. Because on the counter attack, it would just kill me. So instead of playing on defensive, I just decided to, hey, why not just play on balance so that's what I did I decided to play on balance and wow that was there a difference I mean he wouldn't track back as much although he couldn't help it but he would be up front more than usual which is one of the things I really liked about him I mean if he's up front he's gonna score simple header uh, finesse shot long shot it doesn't matter he'll score whichever way it doesn't matter and that is why he was able to outshine every other player. I mean, he would be there. He would finish it. And even with his weak foot, it doesn't, I mean, he does have three-star weak foot and three-star skills. So he can't really do much instead of like McGinney spins or Berva spins or um, he can't do anything fancy uh, such as that. But he could get the job done. He's a target man. He's not going to be one that will make the pretty little plays. But instead, he's going to finish and make you win the game. Which is why I was able to win uh, League 1 twi two times in a row. His strength, it says he has 76 strength. But I believe he does feel like a tank and he does feel slow. So if you're looking for pace, for a pacey striker, he's not going to be the one. He feels more like a bus. But that bus will be really hard to take down. Which is why he's great for a target man as I said before. And that is why I would have to rate him at least a 9 for the prize because he's dropping and I'm sure he's going to be on the team of the season for FIFA 13 I'm sure he's going to be on the team of the season so no matter what I mean it's going to be a good investment thank you for watching this review and I hope I hope that wasn't too wrong about him because he he is a great player he is a great finisher and I'm sure if you guys give him chance he will he will surprise you guys thank you